हेलो गाइज आई होप ऑल ऑफ यू आर फाइन इन टूडेज वीडियो वी विल बी डिस्कसिंग द कंसेप्ट ऑफ लेफ्ट मोस्ट डेरिवेशन राइट मोस्ट डेरिवेशन एंड पार्स ट्री और इट इज नोन एज डेरिवेशन ट्री सो देर आर मेनी वेज इन विच द स्ट्रिंग कैन बी डिराइव वी हैव टू पिक द अप्रोप्रिएट पॉसिबल रूल आफ्टर अप्रोप्रिएट पॉसिबल रूल इज पिक वी हैव टू चेक विच नॉन टर्मिनल टू पिक बिकॉज नॉन टर्मिनल इज द ओनली वन विच विल डिराइव द स्ट्रिंग so we always start from starting symbol and then we have to derive a particular string by picking the right uh, most uh, non terminal or left most non terminal again uh, that is up to the question and that is up to the string that we are deriving now this is a question which is given to us where uh, your s value is given as 0 uh, 0 b and 1 a a value is given as 0 0 s 1 a a b value is given as 1 1 s 0 b b obviously it means there are three non terminals which are used s a b uh, there are two no, uh, there are three non terminals actually used which are s a b uh, two uh, terminals and we have production rule given on the above and we have the starting state which is s which is a starting symbol now how we have to use e, i have written lmd rmd and parse tree or derivation tree lmd means left most derivation rnd means right most derivation and parse tree is the tree that i will be constructing so kindly watch the video till the very end now i am using lmd which is left most derivation over here it means i have to basically because i have to derive a string so the string that uh, we are going to derive i'm writing string over here 00110101 so this is a string that we are actually uh, deriving so i will start with deriving of a string from the very starting symbol and i assume that it is taking many steps to solve it so i'm writing star over here now uh, i have to start somewhere since the string is 00110101 so i have to pick the correct uh, rule for it so s is giving two rules 0b and 1a obviously the string is starting from 0 if it is starting with 0 so i have to pick that rule that starts with 0 and that rule would be 0b so it means 0b rule is picked now i have to pick a non terminal out of it because non terminal only generate strings so there is only one non terminal which is given which is b and b is generating 1 1 as 0 b b guys i could have written 1 over here the string would have been finished with 0 1 but i don't i don't require it i can write 1 s over here then the string will start with 0 1 which you don't want and there is only one option left which is putting the value of b as 1 s you have got 0 1 s right now uh if i if i write like that uh, i will get zero ones which i don't want so there is only one option which is left by putting the value of b as 0 bb now what is left most derivation the left most derivation is you have to pick if there are two or three non terminals which you see in the entire string you have to pick the left most one so whatever answer that is going to come it's going to come but we have to pick the left most non terminal by picking the left most non terminal i need to get the string with two zeros we have already achieved then there is this one which is supposed to be achieved so if i have to achieve this one i can use uh, three answers of b i could use 1s right i could use 1 or i could use 0bb i'm using 1s over here so if i use 1s over here we have got 011 001, 001 actually and this s i can take any value there are three uh, two values of this uh, s uh, either 0b or 1a but you want you have already got 001 then there is another one that you want so obviously you will put 1a over here so you have got 0 0 1 and 1 a over here now you have to take a and b again guys let me tell you that uh, you have to derive certain cert certain answers so uh, again uh, you have already got 0 0 1 1 and this a and this b i could finish them a by giving 0 and b by giving 1 
but I don't want because I still want 0101 string at the end of the day. So I would uh, put this value of uh, 1 uh, A as I can put it as 0 S right I can put it as 0 S S value I can take it as because I have already got 0011 and then 0 is also achieved I want 101 so we have got this S as 1 A right now this 1 A has come and again I have to put the value of A a value I can put it as 0 0 1 1 0 1 and 0 0 over here and there is this B left and this B value can be taken as 1 so hence 0 0 1 1 0 1 0 1 is definitely present in this uh, particular string we can be deriving this particular string over here now comes the concept of rightmost derivation the rightmost derivation again we have to again we have to achieve this string 0 0 1 1 0 1 0 1 again we have to use but now if there are two non terminals which will come we will pick the rightmost non terminal out of it now you can see clearly i have to start somewhere so there are two ways in which i can start 0 b or 1 a clearly you have a string that starts with 0 so i'm writing 0 b there is no other non terminal which can be deriving only b is there so i have to write the value of b now guys take this thing in consideration you have already got zero so you want another zero that should come over here so obviously you can pick one a but you can pick zero b as well but if i pick one a i will write zero one which starts with zero one it doesn't start with zero one so i have to write zero b over here so i have written this so zero b is written over here now guys it's up to us that what kind of answer that we need to put it with we have got 0011101 i after two zeros are there now i have to concentrate on this value of zero uh, see this value of b can be taken as uh, this value of b uh, we have we started with zero b and we have to take the value of b so we have three answers one one s zero bb clearly so it has to start somewhere so we will be starting with zero b so i can clearly write it as one or i can write it as one s or i can write it as zero bb so clearly i don't want one and one s y because that would mean i will start with zero one so obviously i would write zero bb now the point is that i have to pick the rightmost non-terminal we have two non-terminals over here pick the rightmost one uh, if you pick the rightmost one again you have to take this answer of b uh, guys you already have zero zero b over here the rightmost non-terminal can give us one it means we'll end with one uh, it can give us one s or it can give me zero bb since in the on the right side we have to focus on right side right side one we need to achieve i could terminate it with one but there are many answers that will come in between so i would rather use one s over here so it means i will be using one s over here again i will be using this particular term uh, s now s value again uh, it's up to you that whatever value you want to put with s value can give us 1 a it can give us 0 b but if if you use 1 a rule you may end with 0 but you have to end with 1 so i will rather use the concept of 0 0 b 1 and s value taken as 0 b right right i can take any other value of this particular b with 1 1 as 0 b b I would rather take it as 1s again just see 0 1 b 0 so in this uh, what we have got 1b uh, can give us certain particular value so s value is 0b or 1a I would rather again use 0b over here you write 0b over here 1 0 1 b 0 now on the right side just check I have achieved everything 0 1 0 you can easily get 1 from this because b is also producing 1 you have got 1 
जीरो वन जीरो वन सी क्लियरली जीरो वन जीरो वन जीरो वन जीरो वन इज अचीव वन बिफोर ऑफ दैट इज ऑल्सो अचीव टू जीरोज आर ऑल्सो अचीव देर इज दिस वन टू बी अचीव दिस बी ओनली देर इज वन बी विच इज लेफ्ट इफ आई राइट इट एज वन यू हैव गॉट दिस स्ट्रिंग डन सो दिस इज राइट मोस्ट डेरिवेशन फॉर दिस पर्टिकुलर स्ट्रिंग अगेन लेफ्ट मोस्ट मीन्स पिकिंग द लेफ्ट मोस्ट नॉन टर्मिनल राइट मोस्ट मीन्स पिकिंग द राइट मोस्ट नॉन टर्मिनल देन वी हैव द नेक्स्ट पर्टिकुलर थिंग द नेक्स्ट पर्टिकुलर पार्ट इज डेरिवेशन ट्री गाइज इफ आई टॉक अबाउट डेरिवेशन ट्री डेरिवेशन ट्री अगेन फॉर डेरिवेशन ट्री इट इज ऑल्सो नोन एज पार्स ट्री यू कैन क्रिएट अ ट्री विद Uh, by using leftmost derivation because over there uh, you can actually get the string which is done again the tree is uh, going to start from the starting symbol only the root of the tree is the starting symbol it means root is equal to starting symbol now if your root is your starting symbol so you always have to start with this s now again picking the right most rule is the important part you want to achieve double zero double one zero one zero one again so i will be writing s is giving us zero b so wherever any non terminal comes in a tree just write its value all the string is achieved from terminals only from the left side i will be calculating the terminals and you will see that particular answer we have got 0 b over here now this 0 b i have written this particular b will have some certain answer uh, i could take this value of b as 0 b b now again this b value this b value can be taken as 1 s right uh this s value can be taken as 1a so i would rather uh, create a tree with more space so i'll just see i start with s i have written it as 0b this b as we written as 0bb right this b can be written as 1s this s because i am see i am achieving 001 see 10101 i have to achieve this one so i it means from s i will have to pick that rule that starts with one i can write 1a right from this a 0011 is achieved 001 now you have to achieve zero so it means this a will write that rule that uh, starts with zero i can write it as 0s so we have got 00110 now i have to pick a, a particular rule that starts with 1 so again i can write 1a then i can give this value of it as 0 and i can give it value of 1 it a uh, value of b as 1 so in derivation tree important tip is that everything is terminated by a terminal only so whatever is terminated by terminal from the left side just calculate what answers you are getting if you are getting that particular string it means yes you have derived using derivation tree or parse tree so it is terminated with zero it is terminated with zero it is terminated with one it is terminated with one it is terminated with zero 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 and last it is terminated with one so calculation of a string is double zero then double one Zero one zero one. Hence, uh, this is uh, the derivation tree of this particular string. Again, it means this string belongs to this language, and we have used many number of steps to calculate it. That means S is definitely deriving zero zero one one zero one and zero one. Hopefully, this part is clear to you. If you have any doubt, kindly post in comment section. Kindly like, share, and subscribe, and share it with the maximum of audience. Thank you very, very much.